so so I just wanted to pop in here and let you guys know that you can restart your day whenever you want to and as many times as it takes in order to start your day. So let's go over my Wednesday so far. I woke up at 6.30 a.m., hopped out of bed to get my coffee, and literally stepped barefoot in some of Turbo's dog poop. Like barefoot in between my toes. Like, hor the, the, probably one of the most horrifying ways you can start your day. And I was like, oh man, poor Turbo is still sick. So I rinsed off my foot. I sprayed off my foot, stepped in dog poop. And I got my cup of coffee and I laid in bed. My foot was clean. I cleaned up all the poop. Poor Turbo is still sick. And I um, laid in bed. I was like, I'm going to restart my day. And so I get out of bed and I have my coffee and I start my workout. I'm halfway through my workout and I get an email informing me that I have been, and like, look, look at this freaking smile on my face, an email informing me that I have been rejected from the athlete program that I applied for um, to be a mountain athlete. Uh, because they only take professional athletes, and I guess I am not yet a professional athlete. Which, so it's a total long shot that I was going to get it anyway. And when I told people that I applied for it, they were like, Courtney, like that, you're probably not going to get it. But here's the thing. I believe in myself so much that I believe that, that I believe that when I apply for something that it, I actually have like this legitimate chance that it's going to happen. Because I believe in myself. And I think that's a good thing. And so I was super bummed. And immediately afterwards, I get an email from a girl saying, um, you know, she was going to sign up for my winter conditioning program. And then she decided that she wasn't in the last minute. So I'm like, all right, sweet. Like, how's this? How is this Wednesday going? Uh, and now guess where I am? I, um... I just had my yearly appointment at the lady doctor, which is also maybe a little too much information. But guys, it is not even noon yet. It is not even noon yet. And this is how my Wednesday has been going so far. Oh, and I found out that um, a bunch of other women that I work with, um, I, I, I thought that I was, I thought that I had gotten this bonus that I've been working towards and I didn't get the bonus. And I was like, I mean, whatever, that's fine. Like, that's actually not that big of a deal. But to me, any one of these things, any one of these things could have ruined somebody's day. Any one of these things. But I am here. It's not even noon. And I'm still smiling because this is something that I really, really believe in and Brayden really believes in too. And we talk about it a lot is that you have... You can't control other people's actions. You can't control everything that's going on around you. The only thing that you can control is your reaction to it. And so honestly, guys, my reaction to this, to, to all this stuff that like really in the scheme of things is not bad. Like it just shows that I'm putting myself out there and that I'm trying really hard. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm trying for things that are out of my reach that are like, that are way over here still. But for me, I think that if I don't reach for those things that are way over there, that maybe that, that I'll never get them. I'll never get there. Um, and so the only thing I can control is I can't control the fact that they didn't accept me into the program. I can't control the fact that I stepped in dog shit barefoot this morning. I mean, I probably could have controlled that, but you know what? Like I can't control the fact that, you know, somebody doesn't want to work with me. Like I can't control any of that. I can just keep doing the best that I know how to do and keep pushing forward and control my reaction to everything. And so today my reaction is going to be filled. It's just going to feel to feel filled with joy and gratitude for the day. Um, and that's all I can do. Really, that's like literally all I can do because it's not even noon and I have the rest of my day in front of me. So I was going to do this like long Facebook or Instagram post about, you know, how I stepped in shit 
and I got two rejection letters and I didn't get the bonus I thought I was going to get and then I had to go to the lady doctor and oh they I found out they weren't um my insurance wasn't paying for my doctor visit you know like there's like literally a hundred things that could have affected my mood today and made me really 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 bummed but I'm not going to be bummed because I can change and l let me tell you guys I was bummed for a little bit there like for a good 15 minutes I was sad I was bummed because I put myself out there and I tried something and it didn't work out and I felt like a failure, but it was like literally for a minute. And then I realized that I'm not a failure for trying something that makes me a success. Like right off the bat, I had more of a chance of getting this stuff or, or of working with this girl or getting the mountain athlete program than anybody that didn't try. So calling it a win, calling it a successful day, and knowing that I control my mood and I control my reactions. Um, I could sit around and cry all day long into my coffee about how shitty, literally, of a day I'm having. But instead, it's gorgeous outside today. It's Wednesday. I'm happy. Um, and I hope that you guys are having a great day too. And if you're having a bad day, just think, I woke up this morning and stepped in poop, barefoot, in between my toes. I was like in the shower, washing it off and laughing hysterically at 625 this morning because what else am I going to do? Honestly, guys, like what else do you do in those situations but laugh really freaking hard? What else do you do in your rejection, rejection letter but laugh really freaking hard? Like just keep on trucking guys. I'm not going to stop. And that's also the point. Like if you get these rejections, if stuff happens, don't stop. Like don't give up on yourself. Like I will, that's one thing about me. I will never give up on myself. Cause like I said, literally I believe in myself got more than anybody that I know. Like I have such a belief and I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I think it's a good thing. So keep being you, keep doing you. I hope you all have a great Wednesday. I hope your Wednesday is better than my Wednesday. Happy hump day. Keep on trucking, friends.